Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use ScreenPal to record your screen or create a screencast. Now, before we go any further, I should point out that ScreenPal used to be called Screencast-O-Matic. It has a new name, but it has all the same great features that it had before. So let's go ahead and take a look at how it works. You can see I already have it launched here on my Mac and I want to create a new recording. And when I do, you'll see that I have my webcam turned on. I'm down there in the bottom right corner of the screen. And that webcam is going to move regardless of how much of my screen I'm capturing. I'm always going to be there in the picture. I can move myself up and around and all over the screen. And that's because I have the option for recording both my screen and camera. Now I should point out that I can make my screen a little bit bigger like this. And in the upper right hand corner of that function, I can change out my virtual background. Right now I'm using this mountains background. I could switch it up to be just a blur or I might say no background at all. And if I have a green screen, I will select I have a green screen and use that little green screen option right there. But for now, let's go back and put myself in this nice little tranquil mountain scene. Click OK and I'm back to this position and I want to go ahead and record my screen now. And so now I'm recording and I want to remove myself and put myself a little smaller here and say, hey, look at this. This is my puppy who's sleeping. And now I can bring up anything on my screen, including my ScreenPal account, or I might just go to a cool website like freetechforteachers.com and show people something that's on it, like this article about AI tools that are coming to Google Workspace. And I can then conclude the video by saying, hey, thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, feel free to send me an email. And then I'll stop the recording and I can click done. And ScreenPal will let me edit the video or simply save and upload that video to keep on my computer and then use anywhere else that I would like. Let's rename it quickly so it's not recording to, let's just call it demo recording. And I'm going to go in here and save this as a video file. Now you'll see that I could trim it by just clicking and dragging those pieces, or if I want to edit it even further. I'll go into that edit setting where I can then edit things like the size of the camera view at the start of my video. And I can make that a little smaller. And then I'm going to save that. And now I'm going to save my video as a video file on my computer so I can use it anywhere I want from here on out. So that's a short overview of how you can use ScreenPal to create screencasts on your computer. As always, for more things like this, please visit practicaledtech.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.